Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Jack Severity here with another gaming review. This time we are playing the next car game, Wreckfest, as it's called. Yep, that whole name, the next car game, Wreckfest, is the name of this game. This game is in alpha and it is on Steam. I think it's about 55 Australian dollars and I think it's worth every cent of it. There will be uh, the next update, as far as I've been told, you can actually race lawnmowers in it, so I'm pretty stoked about that. Who doesn't like racing lawnmowers? I don't know. The Pope? Uh, someone. Someone, some dickhead. Anyway, let's check it out. Seven cars to choose from. Every car has a number of uh, paint jobs you can go through. We'll just click on another one just so you can see it, but we will go back to this one since it's black and is the best. You can also change your... Um, engine size, gearbox, all that jazz. Uh, fully customize the car to how you want it after you unlock a bit of stuff. In this mode here, you can actually check out your uh, hog of a motor. There we go. You can open the door. We'll just slowly get around here. So you can check out how beautiful it looks inside. And also, most important, you can check the boot in case... Uh, the guy that owned it before you decided to put a body in there and you don't want to get done by the cops, so you probably should check that before you take it on the track. Or he put a cat in there, and either way, we don't like cats, so you want to get that thing out of there pretty quick. Uh, game modes are Destruction Derby, uh, just circuit races, figure out races. Um, the only problem I have with this game so far that I've sort of worked out is the driver assist. The ABS traction control and stability is not very good it sort of doesn't do a whole lot i would love to give my father a go at this game since he loves cars but he's not a gamer it would be it's just it's just too hard for someone that doesn't play this sort of stuff to get into they should fix it make it a little bit easier the only game mode he probably could be able to do all right on is the stadium mode which is destruction derby doesn't matter if you spin out we'll get in there and have a go but yeah this game is in pre-alpha uh it's it's really fun. I apologise for the frame drop a bit because uh, I'm recording at the moment as well, obviously, and, and trying to suss out my uh, the best way to do it on this computer. But we'll give it a go. There we go. Show the, uh, the camera views real quick, especially this one, because after not very long, this camera view is pointless because your bonnet lifts up and you can't see anything anymore. And we'll go for... We'll try to go for all the small little gay cars because they are gay. If you like small cars, well, enough said. But there is uh, plenty of big tanks, big V8s to sort of go from, so I kind of hope you would better use one of that. But let's go to this one so I can actually see what I'm doing. There also is this camera view, which I love. It makes it <laughs> just wicked, but... Obviously, you can't play properly on this camera view, but let's just do it for a minute and do some skids and just show how awesome my banged up car looks. Bottom left-hand side shows the, the health of every corner of your car. Uh, you notice the top left, my car's on red. It means it's kind of not loving life a lot, so the engine. Um, so pretty much, yeah, you smash around like this for a while, go forward, and then um, when the front of your car is pretty knackered, just start reversing. The reversing is kind of annoying because you don't go all that fast as I'll be uh, cracking it now. You can see how beautiful the front of my car looks. Looks like an AU Falcon, if any of you guys know what AU Falcons look like. Hopefully there's some Aussies out there that watch this and laugh at that. <laughs> Funny Jack. Funny Jack. Anyway, yeah, this car game is very fun. I haven't played another one for probably, I reckon, I don't know, a good 10 years or so. Because there's been nothing worth playing. This game uh, has made me want to go ahead and buy another or a racing steering wheel for my computer just to play it. Because it's it's good fun. And, uh, I gave my missus a go of it last night. She's not a gamer. She didn't want to have a go. She didn't end up, I talked her into it, she had a go. And then I think she had probably another eight or nine goes afterwards and couldn't get enough of it. <laughs> she thought it was pretty fun. So that is about it guys, uh, this is the next car game, Wreckfest, hope you enjoyed the video and uh, don't forget to hit that like button, don't be a little puff and not like it, catch ya.